A medical student from our area is down south helping patients in hard-hit Louisiana. The state has seen almost four times as many deaths as Ohio. We have News Center 7, Sean Cudahy live in Fairborn with what that student is doing there. Sean? James, students here at Wright State's Boonshoff School of Medicine have not been able to hold in-person classes. They also haven't been able to do their rotations in the hospital in part because of the shortages in PPE. This student, though, is a nurse who, as well, he's also worked at Kettering Medical Center and has headed south to help in the outbreak in one of the hardest hit areas. They've been getting hit with a lot of patients. Over FaceTime, Wright State medical student Kyle Henneke, originally from Huber Heights, told News Center 7 the hospital he's working in has seen a steady stream of coronavirus. There's a lot. There's a lot of COVID down here. Um, almost every patient that we come into contact with is either um, COVID suspected or known COVID positive. Henneke signed an eight week contract to work as a nurse in New Orleans where rare video of empty streets gives you a sense of the outbreak's scope there. For perspective, fewer than 7,000 COVID-19 cases in Ohio. Louisiana has seen more than 21,000. Ohio has had 274 patients die compared to 884 in Louisiana. I think a lot of nurses are, are tired. I think a lot of physicians are tired. Um, they're getting a little exhausted. Um, but at the end of the day, we're here to help people, and that to us, I think, comes first. We asked Henneke about the gear he's using after the governor there said in recent days. I am um, pleased to tell you that we have distributed 7.5 million items of PPE thus far. Henneke says he has an N95 mask, but instead of using it for one patient, he wears it until it goes bad. He says his hospital has a good supply of rubber gloves, but not of gowns. All that PPE, part of a nationwide shortage. We're trying to make do with what we've got. And what about the long, intense hours? I'm here to, to help. I'm here to do a job, and I, I don't think much of anything else. And I can tell you other Wright State med students have been helping right here in the Miami Valley as well, uh, organizing PPE drives or taking part in those drives rather to collect that uh, gear that people or hospitals need so much and also calling senior citizens to talk with them as they might be isolated at home during this time. Live on the Wright State campus in Fairborn, I'm Sean Cudahy, News Center 7.